Hey everyone, well, I'm Arwazi and welcome back to Dungeon of the Endless. So, we completed the fifth floor. And let's move on. We saved 56 industry, 43 science, and 65 food. That's pretty decent. This is enough food to level up on someone. Other than the tanky damage dealer dude. The slowpoke guy. <laughs> What's his name again? Gork. I might save up for him. And I probably will. Change of scenery. <laughs> Doesn't look very inviting. Okay. How much do I need to level him up? 23. Yeah, I think I'll save up for him. So, let's move then. Which way? Doesn't really matter, I suppose. We have no idea what to expect. There's a slot here, so that's a good thing. Let's get industry generator. Like so. And move to the next room immediately. I'll just keep everyone grouped for now. What's this? Plus 50% everything. I didn't want it this early, but alright. Let's get some static defenses in this room. Like so. Pepper spray. Okay, pepper spray is good. And some prisoner prods. And we can just fight here. Seems like a good idea. Okay, this dude can stay back here now. Because he's so slow. Yes, I will keep reminding him. How slow he is. You are supposed to be here, not there. Now this floor looks interesting. Not very inviting, that's for sure. More dust. And nasty things. And there's a slot in here. Let's use that. For food. Or science? Nah, let's get food. New levels require quite a lot of food now. And we level up this guy. He won't get anything special, but he'll get more stats. And I'm okay with that. 88 for the next level. Alright, let's move on then. Oh yeah, now I should defend the crystal. We got what? A merchant? Or what? You just made someone. No, that's just a recruit. Level 5. Okay, well, you can stay there for now. And power this, so I won't have to defend my crystal. Too much? Or the replicator, I mean. Alright, let's move on. Oh yeah, there's a slot here now. Because the buff is gone. Let's use that then. For science. Yep. Science. So I got industry, science, and food now. Let's move on. Six is when science. We got someone. Vendor? Nope. Another hero. Oh, level two. Not very good then. I don't think I want to replace any of my heroes. No, not really. Cryo capsule. Activate using 20 industry? Alright. What did we get? Nothing? I don't think we got anything. No, it doesn't look like it. There is no message. Okay. 81 science. I need a science crystal soon. Or literally right now. So, you know, actually research something. Not that our science will run away. It will still be here. Okay, we got enough to build something. Actually, no, we don't. What am I talking about? Let's power this up anyway. And this. And I could set up in this room instead. Oh yeah, the monsters will attack the hero. Not that I really care about him. There's a research crystal. Oh yeah, Ford Replicator, right, I wanted that. So that's a no-brainer, I'm not even going to think about this. Let's move over here then. There is a slot here. Can't use it yet. Let's set up a few things. Pepper spray. And one more prod. Is there a slot over there? No, there isn't. Okay. 
Nothing can spawn up here, so I'll just defend in that room. And we got incoming. Doesn't look too bad. Just keep an eye on our health. I'll just use the buff, why not? That was easy enough. Or still is. They are dead. We are at 18 industry. And 66 food. Is this enough food to level up? This guy is level 6 now. I need to start leveling up my other heroes. Is anyone going to get something interesting? New passive ability. Okay, what's this? Monsters in Rome, speed minus 4. Okay. Does that mean she gets minus 4 speed or the monsters get minus 4 speed? <laughs> I assume the monsters get minus 4 speed. Well, let's move on then. And that's passive ability that works all the time. And here's the exit. We are obviously not going there yet. The escort shouldn't be too hard. Looks pretty easy to me. Let's keep moving this way. Yeah, okay. Keep moving this way. That looks simple enough, I think. Come on, kill these things. No more doors down here. Alright, I can unpower this then. And now... Yeah. This is the annoying part. Because if I get big groups of monsters spawning right next to the crystal, some of them might do damage to the crystal. I'll just use some buffs if necessary. Because some monsters beeline for the crystal. Oh, we got load. What did we get? And yes, things are spawning, I can see that. We got stuff. Nano bros. <laughs> okay. Plus 5 wheat, plus 5 health regen, that's a device. Okay, then... I don't have any more slots for devices. That's... No, that's not better than the first aid kit, because first aid kit unlocks health regen. So other heroes. I don't think that's better than the manual that unlocks Team Spirit. Yeah, I'd rather keep Team Spirit. I could replace Battlefield Injector. I'm not really using that. I mean, maybe I should. But I don't have the need to right now. I didn't have to repair anything. I did lose some modules on one of the previous floors. But health regen seems more useful right now. Okay, kill that big thing. Oh yeah, that guy didn't care about me. Come on. Well, everyone is in this room now. Yeah, she'll repair everything. I don't know, maybe I should keep this. But she will still repair stuff without this. Because that's the skill. This is just plus two wheat, which is honestly not that much. Okay, I'll replace that. With the Nano Bros. <laughs> Best item ever. Now I need the merchant to sell that. Anyway. Let's move on. Now I should power this room. To not have stuff spawning in there. No, I'm not picking up the crystal yet. That would be silly. 54 industry. Enough to build something. Yep, things are spawning. Let's use the buff. This guy is pretty good now. And I didn't even use the Warcry ability. Which gives him plus 20 defense. That's sick. What's his defense without that? 65. So that would more than double his defense. And he's already quite tanky. Yeah, I should actually repair my static defenses after every turn. I've not been doing that. Okay. We're not in the clear yet. Now we are. 
So let's move on. I could set up some static defenses around here now. Well, I'll use this room, that's for sure. For what? Now I could use tactical HUD. Okay, let's actually use tactical HUD. I've not been using it much, but I should. And some prods. Only two slots in this room, unfortunately. More stuff. And nothing is happening. Is that a machine gun? Wait, no. Yeah, things are incoming. What kind of weapon is that? That is a machine gun. Minus 3 speed, 23 attack. Minus 0 0.2 cooldown. Do I want... Oh, this is the same exact weapon this guy is using. Okay. 24 attack. 23 attack. No, this is not the same exact weapon. This is a better version. So I'll replace this. This is a slightly better version. Not much better, but hey, it's better. Come on. Looks like we're safe. What's that thing? Doesn't look very pleasant. So, 56 food. Is that enough to level up? It is. 52 food. No one is going to get any extra abilities. Well, let's level up then. We'll get extra passive skill on the next level. So, keep moving. I'll just keep this guy in this room. Did I repair things? I think I did. Yep. Alright, next. 22 industry, that's not enough to do anything. Right now. Let's move this way. There is one more slot here, so I can use that once I get enough industry. And yet another slot here, and we got some loot. We got tightrope, whatever that is. That's a spear, which means I can't use that. Okay, 54 attack power, wow. Okay, that's pretty good. But I don't have anyone who would be able to use that. Not the kind of weapon that anyone in this group can use. So I'll just sell it once I find a vendor. Shame there's no minimap. That's my only minor complaint about the game. Yeah, you can zoom out and this is very informative and good. But I would still like a minimap of some sort. Like anything. Same goes for Endless Legend. I'd really like to see a minimap in Endless Legend. It's a very, very minor thing, but it still would be nice. So let's build something somewhere right here, maybe. For the replicator. Sounds good. More food is never a bad thing. Oh, did I lose something on this slot? Well, doesn't matter, I guess. No, I don't think I did. Zero industry, so that's perfect, I suppose. This floor looks like it's almost done. Probably. So, keep moving this way. Okay, now we can back up and fight next to the tactical HUD. Because at least I have two prisoner pros in there. What was this exactly? Oh yeah, extra attack power to all heroes in the room. Let's use that. Probably not necessary, but whatever. Well, that was an easy fight. So, keep moving. Looks like we might be done soon. 36 fold. I need 52 for this guy. Okay. What was this guy's ability? Oh yeah. Attack power divided by number of heroes in the room. Right. 
I can stack quite a few attack power buffs now. And yeah, we are getting monsters. Let's just pause. Industry generator. That's a no-brainer, I think. What's this? Okay. Attack power for each stocked science. Maximum attack power 100. Interesting, but I still prefer industry generator, honestly. Oh, yeah. We can't do that anymore. Because we opened everything. That kind of sucks. Oh, well, maybe another time. It's not like science will run away. Buff up a bit. This guy is pretty amazing now. So, time to pick up the crystal after this fight. Who's going to carry it? That works. I think he might need some help. So let's go help him. Nope, he doesn't need any help. He's badass enough to handle it on his own. Alright, let's pick up the crystal, but first... I'll deactivate this. And let... Monsters chase me. That worked before, so it should work. Just fine right now. Alright, let's do it then. So pick it up and let's run. I can... Right, I can't actually trigger this ability while I'm carrying the crystal, I suppose. But she's still pretty damn fast with that. Yeah, this is going to be the easiest crystal escort ever. Yep. But sometimes crystal escorts can be pretty hard. It really depends on the layout. But so far this method is working really nicely. And we're here. So, the floor is done. That was 6th floor? No, that was 5th floor. So we're moving on to 6th one. We saved 18 industry, 93 science, 53 food. This will be a bit of a shorter episode, I suppose, but I'm going to finish this one here and continue in the next part. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you again soon.